Hello, Cardiff Devils fans. I am delighted to uh, be able to introduce the newest signing for the Cardiff Devils upcoming season, Matt Register. Matt, how are you, sir? Hey, uh, not too bad, not too bad. Uh, just finally getting home here. Um, Going to be a short turnaround, but uh, very excited to be uh, heading down to Cardiff here in about a month or so. We're very excited to have you uh, join us as well. Um, Matt, you've got a, an extensive North American career. You've played uh, that side of the pond the entire time. Um, why decide to come to Europe now? Yeah, I mean, it's just, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting to be 30. I'm going to be 32 this year. And, um, you know, I, I had a great career here in North America, and I've won a lot of championships. I've won three championships here. I've had a pretty nice little uh I got a nice resume going here but um you know it's it's time for a new chapter for me and um um my agent is uh he's really close with Jared Scaldi and uh um I've had a few friends playing Cardiff in the past and they said nothing but great things about the organization and um you know it's and coming from some of the owners uh being a Calgary guy myself and them being from Calgary you know it's uh you know I think it'd be a perfect fit for me so um, I'm excited to try it for a year. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm going to love it, but, uh, you know, at the end of the day for me, it was just, uh, something new for me. I mean, it was just kind of, kind of getting old now over here, you know, doing the same thing every year. And, um, you know, don't get me wrong. I, I enjoyed every minute of, minute of it, but, uh, it's time to, it's time to move on to, uh, something a little bit new and, and, and exciting and, uh, a different chapter. You mentioned you had a, a couple of friends playing Cardiff previously, uh, can you drop some names for us? Yeah, so a real good buddy of mine, Sam Jardine, um, played there. And, um, you know, I played against Mark Lewis. Um, you know, I know I know some of those guys. And, um, you know, I, I, I had a few talks with Jard, Jards before, uh, you know, ultimately ended up signing with Cardiff. And um, it was an easy, easy decision after talking with him. I mean, he, uh, he enjoyed every minute of there. And, uh, uh, I mean, so will I. So I'm excited mm -hmm. and, and looking forward to it. Uh, what excites you most about this new challenge in your career? You know what, honestly, I think, uh, you know, Cardiff being in the Champions League, I, I mean, I've heard a lot of great things. I've had some some buddies over the years that have played in that league and, and on some of those teams. And, um, you know, I'm looking forward to that new chapter. I'm playing against some of those elite teams over there and those guys and some of those players over there. And, um, you know, it's going to be a challenge, but, um, you know, I'm ready for the challenge. And, uh no, I've done my, my research on Cardiff and, and I'm looking forward to playing in front of that fan base. You know, I love playing in front of a wild fan base that's passionate and, you know, cares about their team in the community. And, uh, you know, those things kind of excite me and get me wrapped up, ready to go. Devils fans love it when uh, a new face arrives and uh, they get to see them hit the ice for the first time. Um, what can they expect from you as a player? What are your strengths? Yeah, I think, uh, I, I formed into a nice two way defenseman. Um, you know, I'm, I, I got a lot of high-end skill in the offensive zone. But, um, you know, in the defensive zone, I, I've learned a lot from taking care of my own end. Um, you know, it it's, starts in your own end. And I got a great stick. Um, I work smart. You know, I, I get pucks to the net, um, make a great first pass. Um, you know, I, I consider myself kind of an all-around player. That, um, um, and I, I owe a lot of credit to, to all the the coaches and staff and organization I played for here in North America that have really developed me and, and, and made me kind of learn the hard way on, you know, what kind of role I should be in and, and, and take pride in my own zone. That'll turn into the offensive zone. So, you know, at the end of the day, I think, uh, um, what I'm going to bring to the table that, uh, you know, the, the management and coaching staff and fans are going to, are really going to enjoy. I've uh, been doing my research on you, uh, today and saw a few videos, uh, not a bad cannon of a shot either. I've seen the uh, All-Star, uh, <laughs> ECHL All-Star weekend, finishing top of the uh, the powerful shots there. So uh, not afraid to maybe ding one in either from the blue line. No, absolutely. Um, I got a pretty heavy shot too. Um, when I got time to load it up, I mean, other than that, if, you know, if I don't got time to load it up, then I got to just got to get the puck to the net, you know, plain and simple. But uh, no, I, uh, I I love winding up. I've got a hard shot, and I, I, I like to use it uh, in the right times. That, that's your physical attributes and what you bring there, but your resume speaks for itself in terms of um, championships, three-time Kelly Cup champion, four-time ECH All-Star, 
two-time ECHL defenseman of the year. When you're going into this locker room for the Devils now, how much of that winning mentality are you looking to uh, inflict on the organization? And was it a perfect fit for you when you seen how successful the club had been in the last few seasons? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, you know, coming in, uh, I got a winning mentality. I want to win. I expect to win. And, um, you know, coming down there, you know, I'm not, uh, not a young guy anymore. I want to come down there and kind of, and lead by example and, and bring that winning mentality down there. And, uh, you know, finishing the year, you know, next year, it's, uh, it's going to be unacceptable if we don't bring home a championship, you know, that's, uh, kind of in my mind. And, uh, um, that's how I, uh, just kind of came around and brought my head through winning. I mean, now it's, it's a thing where, you know, I, I just, I want to win it's passionate, you know, you know, people want winners and, at the end of the day, I'm looking forward to heading down there with how successful that hockey club is and how much pride they take in their organization to win. I read uh, an interview from a couple of seasons ago when you first signed in uh, Iowa for the Wild, and um, you mentioned about setting targets to increase your plus minus, uh, which you did year on year. Do you still set targets for yourself in the off season? And if so, have you, have you set some targets for, for what you want to achieve in this upcoming season? I do. I mean, um, you know, being an offensive guy, I want to help that power play unit out coming in there. Um, that's a big key for me. Um, you know, specialty teams win championships at the end of the day. Um, you know, obviously the plus minus for me, it's, I take so much pride in that it's, uh, you know, it's kind of underrated in the game where, uh, you want to be a high mentality plus player. Um, you know, you don't want to be on the ice getting scored on every other shift. You don't want to be one of those guys where you can't count on. And for me, it's just uh, something I take very, I don't take lightly. And um, I'm looking forward to coming down there and really showing them that I, not only can I shut top forwards down, but also I could play in that offensive zone and help teams put points on the board and win games that way as well. Well, have you had a chance to see much of the Elite League or did you catch any of Team GB in the, in the World Championships? Have you had a chance to kind of get to grips with some of the teams or has it been a, a bit of a wild uh, suburb? Yeah, so I, uh, my assistant coach this year and Alan uh, actually played for Sheffield for a couple of years. Um, had pretty extensive talks with him. Um, I've had a, quite a few buddies play around the league and, um, you know, I've done my research online, YouTube, kind of looked look through everything and um you know it, it's a solid league there's a lot of you know guys with nhl experience that play in that league there's a lot of you know american league and and um it, it, it's a great league and uh i'm looking forward to getting down there and and seeing for myself firsthand i'm sure it's been explained to you by the, the ownership and, and todd and jared but in the uk the regular season title is the title that everyone wants to win which is a bit of a departure from uh, the way North America runs, where the playoffs are king. Is that um, exciting for you that really the, the quest to, to win the big championship starts pretty much from the first pack drop? Absolutely. I mean, you know, it's in, in North America, you kind of play to, to get to the playoffs and then it's a whole new season in the playoffs. And I'm, I'm not really sure on how many games in, in, in that English league you do play, but I know every game's going to count over there. And I'm looking forward to right from the get go to get going with the puck drop. And, um, you know, I know, I, I know that, you know, you can, you can't lose games. You can't afford to be losing back to back games. there, And, um, you know, that's, that's, uh, that comes with the winning mentality in Cardiff in the organization. And I, and I know they stress that and, and that's an organization organization that wins. So, um, uh, it's going to be, it's going to be fun. It's going to be interesting. I'm looking forward to it for sure. <laughs> well, Matt, I always like to end the interviews and, and hand it over to the player. So Matt, what's your, your message for the Devils fans uh, for the upcoming season? Yeah, Cardiff fans. I mean, I'm, I couldn't be more excited to be joining the organization and, um, you know, this, this off season is going to fly. I know, you, you know, you didn't have a chance to play last year, but, uh, you know, it's coming quickly and, and it's going to be a lot of fun this year. It's going to be fast paced and, uh, you know, we're going to, we're coming in really hot. We're going to win. And, um, you know, we got a good group of guys coming in as well. And, uh, you know, it's going to be a lot of fun and I can't wait to get down there and see what it's all about. Matt, thank you so much for your time 
today and we look forward to welcoming you in Cardiff in the next uh, few weeks and months. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll see everybody soon.